I'm Mike with List 25, and here are the 25 craziest things you might not know about kings. Twenty-five. After King Louis XIV was offered biological weapons by a chemist, he rejected them and paid the chemist to never sell them to anyone else. Twenty-four. At sixteen, King Henry V was hit by an arrow in the face during a battle. He said he would, quote, rather continue fighting than stain his reputation. Twenty-three. Akihito, the Emperor of Japan, is the only remaining monarch on Earth with the title of Emperor. 22. When Napoleon III invited the King of Siam to dinner, he ate with gold cutlery, while the King of Siam ate with aluminum cutlery. This wasn't offensive, though. Back then, aluminum was worth significantly more than gold. 21. Poland was once ruled by a king nicknamed the Strong. Augustus II, because he could break horseshoes with his bare hands, and his favorite sport was fox tossing, which is exactly what it sounds like. 20. Unlike most other writing systems, the Korean script was the deliberate invention of a single monarch, King Sejong in 1443. 19. The doctor to King George V gave him a lethal dose of morphine so that his death could be announced in the prestigious morning papers rather than the less reputable evening journals. 18. Since the President of France is the co-prince of Andorra, this makes Andorra the only nation on Earth with a democratically elected monarch. 17. King Darius III of Persia offered Alexander the Great the equivalent of one billion US dollars today to surrender. Alexander turned it down and proceeded to plow through Persia. 16. When Gandhi once went to meet the King of England wearing only a loincloth, he was asked whether he felt underdressed. He replied that the king wears enough clothes for the both of them. 15. When French soldier Jean Bernadot showed kindness to several Swedish soldiers, Sweden decided to make him king. To this day, the House of Bernadotte rules in Sweden. 14. When the Weibotroy Castle in Germany was defeated in 1140, King Conrad III let the women leave the castle with whatever they could carry. They left carrying the men on their backs. King Conrad III stayed true to his word and let them live. 13. Many French and British kings often had very open affairs. The children of these affairs were called royal bastards and often received money and land. 12. When King of France Jean II was a prisoner in England, the English let him return to France in order to collect ransom in exchange for holding his son. Although his son escaped, the king returned to England citing his honor. 11. King Mithridates VI of Greece tried to poison himself but failed because he had developed immunity over the course of his reign. 10. King George VI was shocked when he visited South Africa in 1947 because he was instructed to only shake hands with white people. He even called his bodyguards the Gestapo. 9. Maria Letizia Romolino is known as the Mother of Monarchs. Her kids include Napoleon, Emperor of France, Joseph, King of Spain, and Louis, King of Holland. 8. King Harold of Norway, who is still king as of this recording, made a vow to remain single unless he could marry Sonia Haraldson, the daughter of a clothing merchant. She eventually became queen. 7. After King Kamehameha of Hawaii was smacked on the head by the paddle of a frightened fisherman during a battle, he did more than just spare the fisherman's life he passed something called the Law of the Splintered Ore. This law still stands today in Hawaii and protects civilians in times of war. 6. Bluetooth technology was named after Harold Bluetooth, the king of Denmark and Norway, because just like Harold united the two kingdoms, Bluetooth technology was intended to unite wireless devices. 5. When Egyptologists realized that the mummy of Ramses II was deteriorating, it was flown to Paris for examination. 
Ramses II was issued an Egyptian passport that listed his occupation as king, deceased. 4. King Leonidas was 60 years old when he fought Xerxes. 3. King Olaf V of Norway used to travel around using public transportation. Not surprisingly, he was nicknamed Folkekong, or the People's King. 2. King George I of England didn't speak English, because he was born in Germany. Since Catholics were not allowed to succeed a monarch in England, he became king since he was the closest living relative of the queen. 1. King Charles VI of France thought he was made of glass, probably because of stress. Enjoying our lists? Be sure to click that subscribe button in the top right corner so you don't miss out on new ones every Monday through Friday. Share them with your friends and help us consistently conciliate curiosity. And if you want even more lists, check out these two videos here or just head to our website at list25.com.